Finally, Link has come back to his channel. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. You're all legends for watching the channel and thank you for watching again. If you haven't subscribed already, there's a little button down there, click it. There's a little thumb down here, which looks like that. Click that too. Um, and leave a comment with any other stuff you want me to review. I'm doing a lot more food reviews recently, trying to get on in with all the new autumn foods and winter foods that are coming out. And today we have got the Dairy Milk, the Raspberry Shortcake, Milk Chocolate studded with Raspberry Pieces, White Crisp Pearls, and shortcake invented by melanie fuller anyone know who she is if you do drop a comment down below i ain't got a clue it says vote to keep me see back of pack for more info so we better check that out only one bar will remain support your favorite at www.cadburyinventor.com have you also tried chocolate i'm not a big fan of coffee so I, I'm not gagging to try it, but if people comment and say they want to see it, I might do it. The other one is called Simply the Zest, which is, I assume, an orange sort of flavour. Um, I was expecting a bit more information on the back than just that little circle there. Um, it's a pretty packet. It's, you know, it's quite... Is that feminine? Am I being harsh? It's quite a feminine sort of packaging with a pink colouration. Uh, I'm not going to vote to keep it because... Well, I might if it's that good. We don't know yet. But... Um, yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of fruit, as you can probably tell by looking at me. Oh, it's hard to break. It's been in the fridge, to be fair. So, in terms of the bar, again, that little new, my new light's helping me out a lot for these sort of food videos. You see, it's got little actual pieces of raspberry in there. I believe that to be dried raspberry. I don't believe, yeah, it's got different colours as you go through the bit of raspberry. So I assume that's not just some sort of like flavour granules that Cadbury's invented, but it might be. Um, and then you can see there's little bits of like Rice crispy, and then there's little bits of what appear to be Rice crispy with a white chocolate coat around the outside. So I don't know if that's a concoction that's going to be good. Um, find out. Hmm. Quite a perfumey sort of. You know when you have the cocktails with a fake flowers and or fake butterflies on top, and it's like it's like a perfumey sort of ice and sugar. It's a little bit like what the bits of raspberry tasting like. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be real, y'all. It's a big bar. I've had one and a half squares, and I don't want no more. It's not a good product. Um, I love dairy milk as well, but it's, it's just it's like you take the perfect chocolate, right? And then you put shit in it that doesn't actually taste very nice. If you really like raspberry, it might be for you, but it's got like a perfumey sort of taste to it, like a tangy. Almost sort of sour, sort of tangy taste to it. Um, can't really describe what the raspberry's like. It's like a really tangy, sour sort of raspberry. And um, the biscuits, I don't feel, add a lot. And the white chocolate, you can't notice it because you've got these tiny little globs of white chocolate and these massive, massive block of brown chocolate. So you can't even taste the white chocolate. So that's pointless putting that in there. Um, yeah, I tell you what, that's actually... How, how harsh are we going to be here, ladies and gents? It's getting a 2 out of 10. I'm sorry, but it's... What's that woman's name? Melanie Fuller, right? If you're watching this, Melanie, you should be ashamed to produce that, right? Now, this might sound harsh to some people watching this, right? But you had the opportunity to sit down... I don't know how it worked. Maybe it was a competition or something. But you had the opportunity to sit down with Cadbury's and make a brand new bar of chocolate, right? And you could have done something with some clever marshmallows or some crispy pieces, or you could have made a mint dairy milk. Where's mint dairy milk? Make all these different dairy milks. What about mint dairy milk? Everybody loves mint chocolate. Christmas coming in a couple of months. Why don't you make mint dairy milk, Mr. Cadbury's? I don't know. Why don't you make something we want? People want 
mint chocolate, especially at Christmas time. They don't want chocolate with white bits you can't taste. Rice Krispies in. I'll buy a box of Rice Krispies and make Rice Krispie cakes if I want Rice Krispies in it. And what that raspberry stuff is, I just can't explain it. I'm so disappointed. I am, I've never ever had a product from Cadbury's, right? Across the whole range. And this is serious now, I'm not even messing about. The whole range that Cadbury's has ever produced, I've never had anything that has disappointed me like that. And I'll tell you what, Melanie Fuller, go fuck yourself, because it's that bad. I'm not having it. Zero out of 10. So I've just Googled it. Apparently, mint dairy milk is already a fucking thing. Who's had mint dairy milk? Have you? You hiding it? Because I've never had it. I can't find it. I've never ever seen it. Never heard of it. Think of it. Think I've got a great original idea. Google it. Been fucking done. If anyone knows what to get mint dairy milk, drop a comment because I'm pissed because I really want some mint dairy milk. I've calmed down a little bit. Um, that product is getting a zero still. I didn't like it, I don't enjoy it. It's a waste of dairy milk in my opinion. But thank you all for watching today. Appreciate everyone watching. Drop a comment with anything you'd like to see me review in the future. And yeah, comment down below if you've tried Melanie Fuller's fucking masterpiece. And yeah, thanks for watching. If you've got any ideas for future videos, future reviews, is there new food you've tried that I haven't reviewed yet? Let me know. But yeah, I will see y'all. Soon. Thanks so much for watching today guys. If you've enjoyed that, you can click up here and you can watch another video of mine. Or if you really love it, if you really, really love it, or even if you just like it a little bit, go down here and subscribe to the channel. It means you'll never ever miss what is coming up real soon.